Yo, this is Clobber9057, and welcome to another unboxing. This time, I'm going to basically be on doing the unboxing of Nyko Power Grip, which is a power grip for the PS Vita. Now, this is essentially for my P PS Vita 1000 series. They have updated, and now they have a 2000 series. So, yep, pick your choice. So, anyway, um, I'm just going to basically be doing an unboxing of this. As well as taking out and showing off my Hatsune Miku skin. And, uh, you know, let me go ahead and do this right off the bat. If you want to uh, get skins or anything else, visit www.pacers.cn.com. Yeah! Like Cartoon Network. Only not as shitty as it was a long time ago. Go. I don't. What the fuck? I don't fucking know where I was going with that. I was saying some, trying to be fucking smart, but I wasn't. Um, also, in a bit, I will be also unboxing the World Ends with You, which is a Square Enix game, and I didn't even know they had these game. This game freaking was still available, brand freaking new, and I got it, and I was like, oh my god, I played it a long time ago, and I'm glad to have it back. So, anyway, let's get to it. Shall we? Now, I'm just gonna unwrap the box itself. Because YOLO. I'm not even gonna tear the shit. Because I wanna keep this box. I like the, uh, I like the glossiness of the, um, controller itself so far. Yes, I just phone on the floor. I'm sorry. Cell phone companies. I'm fucking with your product every day. I eat the wires for breakfast. Okay. Deal with that later. Um, just take it out like that. And I ripped it. I, oh, I failed you unboxing community. Please forgive me for my dumbass three. So here you have the freaking contents right there for the box. And my wild mangled hair grows wildly. Um, yeah, you just got the controller. It looks nice. It looks, it looks nice. nice. Damn, wish I really didn't mess this up. Really wish I did not mess this nice box up. We'll still keep it. I'll still keep it. Hopefully, I just I just taped the shit. Shit's back together. Um, anyway, that's not the point. The point is unboxing this. So, here you have the Nyko controller, and it gives you two more hours of input time. And you get a freaking manual, which it just it tells you how not to fuck up your stuff and lock your screen and crap. But um, I'll figure that out really quick. So let's get to actually getting out this bait, this bad boy, whatever. Hell it is. Bad female. I generally think freaking all PlayStation items or systems are female. I don't know. Maybe I'm weird. I used to call my other, um, my PS2 fucking boss, though. Because, I don't know. And already, it feels like a PlayStation controller. Um, let me give you an overview of it. It looks nice. It's silicone. Um, it's heavy. The feel of it is pretty heavy. Um, there's a USB port so you can charge it up. And there's a USB port for sort of that as well. Um, kind of thought that they would actually have included, like, um, one of those little rubber things to put on top of it when you take it places. Because, obviously, I can't put it in my book bag like this, so I had to put it somewhere safe in my book bag somehow and uh take it with me it's it looks nice and i don't know if that's a volume or not that looks like a volume but if it is that's awesome so you get surround sound um the only thing about this i don't think it actually have has a freaking mic thing so if you want to put in your mic tough nuts you're not going to be able to put in your mic i i think you can actually put in your mic though let me um let me test it out. Now, before I test it out, I'm going to basically go ahead and show you the Hatsune Miku skin. Um, 
Now keep in mind, I may have or may not have completely and utterly. Actually, I don't think I actually did. Nope. Um, didn't do anything. But uh, here's the hot Miku skin, and I actually did not. And I'm putting it close away so you don't see my face yet, because April Fool's Day isn't here. Oh, damn it, I'm spoiling it again. But, um, Hatsune Miku, and she illuminates with the sky, and people are blocking crap, so, yeah, that's, these, these skins are awesome. They feel nice, well, they give you more of a grip. Sadly, I got that little thing bent a little bit, because I wasn't careful, but that's okay, because I don't even give a crap, it still looks elegant. My friends freaking were like, holy shit, you got a Hatsune Miku skin. And yeah, um, here's the back of it. And yeah, that's just basically an overview. It looks fucking beautiful, and I love it. My friend called me a freaking, he kept telling me that that's your waifu. I kept denying it, okay? Um, the guy's name, um, Rayon, or as you may know him by, uh, Toby Mask. <laughs> he, uh, he kept telling me that. Is that your waifu? And I'm like, nah, secretly, I don't even know what a waifu is, so maybe she is, though? I don't know. Anyway, um, it's probably about to mess up when I put this on. Anyway, I don't care, because I am an idiot. Actually, let me, you know what, I'm about to be a noob, noob move, noob move. Um, one second, I'm about to edit this out right now, so, one second. <laughs> Alright, oh yeah, sorry, um, yeah. I stand corrected, pretty much all your ports are able to be played like they were, um, as you can see, I'm sorry, as you can see, it doesn't mess, mess with the skin at all, and that's a lot of glare, I need to wipe the screen, I got the screen protector over it. Um, it feels like a PS4 controller. Matter of fact, give me a second and I will compare it to a PS4 and a PS3 controller just for your benefits. I don't know if you want it to be a PS4 controller or a PS3 controller, but yeah. Alright, so let's, uh, sorry. I just realized I had zoom, the zoom on. Um, as you can see, here's the PS4 controller. And it does not, it has... It kind of feels like it. Um, it has that little arc in the back. If you can see right here, it has a little nice arc right there. And yeah, so that's the PS4 controller. Um, comparing to PS3 controller, I'm sorry, I'm doing multiple types of videos in this one video. Um, but sorry, but um, this one has a, even a more type of art, but the other one's like more rounded. So that's the PS3 control. Also, I was doing another video a while ago. You guys know, yeah, what what? Right, what the fuck am I saying? <laughs> God dang it! <laughs> I'm stupid. Um, so uh, here we have the Nyko, which charges and gives you a nice hold on to your PS PlayStation Portable. And you can also see how Hatsune Miku it continues to show Hatsune Miku the skin itself. So she looks elegant actually doing that. I'm going to basically take test this out later with the Hatsune Miku game, which is a rhythm game, and hopefully it kicks major ass. Um the grippers are arced as well, but it has two um two rounds so that you can fit your hand and it is of course a bigger ass controller for your your needs so that you won't be stupid. Um sorry, I almost showed my face. Um also right here is the lock bu button and letting you know, let me test this out so that my sh brakes and yours don't it doesn't come out it's, it's stuck there like fucking hornets to people's skin because they hate people I don't know I I run out of jokes 
have mercy on me. Oh. Anyway, um, yeah, it has a lock, as well as when you uh, unlock it, you could pull your BS Vita from it. Uh, I'm not gonna show it right now, so, because pretty much I don't want to rip nothing. I'm scared about this this skin as as it as it is. Um, yeah. Also, all the ports that you need, which is the one port that you really w want to need, um, this port right here, which is the um the headphone jack, is accessible. I did not think it was going to be accessible, and I would have to play Hatsune Miku without this thing because, yeah, I look like a fucking asshole playing an anime game while people look at me and be like, "Hey, look you! Why the fuck are you a waifu? Fucking you weebu piece of shizuts! Fuck you! Um, I don't know. I'm just making up shit now." Um, yeah, so anyway, it has this nice as, um, thing where it lets you plug in your headphone jack. Up above, it has your power button so that you can actually power it on, and your necessary volume buttons able to do it, as well as the camera right there, as well as the back camera. So, yeah, take photos with this biscuit and look stylish. That's also that's always a plus. Tested it out just a while ago. Um, just testing it out on my skin, and so far it didn't rip any of the skin layers or rub against it somehow where I had to fucking break my shit up or you know mess up the hinges by any chance. Also, you can put the little thing on there, so that's a big old plus. Um, as far as I can tell, I am about to test it out for about thirty seconds with random Hatsune Miku song and uh I will tell you what my um overall experience on it so far is sorry um guys I just gotta go ahead and continue to record a little bit um so I'm going to re-edit and pause for a second as soon as this loads holy crap this is a pretty unique type of thing um so far, it feels excellent. I love it so far, man. It feels like I'm playing on a PS3. Not PS3, PS4. Which is excellent because, you know, usually PS4 controller is superior controller um, out of the entire PlayStation family. I'm not going to say entire fucking community of controllers because there's obviously a shitload of controllers that could rip that shit apart. Of course... It could do the same, so yeah. Anyway, um, yeah. So far, I like it. Um, as far as Hatsune Miku, the game, um, being played on there, it, uh, it it feels good. Don't get me wrong. Um, I think I will be going ahead and possibly just playing it without it. For now, um, only on Hatsune Miku because Hatsune Miku is meant to be played with the handheld in your hand, pretty much. And, uh, other game, other than that, all the other games will be played without it. It's pretty much why I got Hatsune Miku skin. Smart, right? Because I, um, pretty much want to kind of show it off a little bit. Not that much, but, um, yeah. We'll be playing this with Jack and Daxter Collection and Ratchet and Clank Collection because... You're meant to play it with a controller. So, yeah, as far as how it feels, it feels fucking amazing. It's like you can feel the silicone. It feels nice. It's smooth and, shit, and like, literally, it's outstanding. Um, I guess the only last thing I can do is just show you. Um, go ahead and show. <clears throat> Sorry. Give me a second, guys. I'm going to put you guys right here. And show you the charging. Does it fucking charge? Good gosh, it charges. Um, let me go ahead and show you. Uh, right here it has the green, so it's obviously maxed out. And now it's having the fucking thing blank and shit. 
So let me see. Nope. It's this one's fully charged, so it doesn't need to be charged. But yes, it charges. It um it works fine. So it's not a buggy product. As far as I can tell, I'm going to try to charge it up without this on it. And I will probably be using this a lot. Um holy shit, I'm at 20% power. Um with my with my freaking camera, but honestly, I think if I had to, if I was actually reviewing this, I would give this a fucking um nine point not even a nine point five, a fucking ten. Like this is just amazing. I freaking like this so much. Uh I don't know why this shit's blanking. I guess um it's on there. I'm gonna look at the manual. And uh, see what that's about. I guess it's like it's fully charged. Get take it the fuck off, or it will not charge it no more. So it's not even gonna spawn. So yeah. Um. Honestly, I think this is probably the best thing you would want to get. Be perfect controller, and it charges. It gives you an extra two hours of battery life. You really want this. I know you really want this. To be honest, everybody really wants this because this looks fucking outstanding. I'm going to basically be playing a lot of games in the meanwhile on this and like in controller. It's it's fantastic. That's all I can say. I can't give any more regard. If you got PS Vita, pick this up right away. It's too um I I don't I forgot what the price was. I think it was thirty five dollars or something. But something I don't know. It was like I don't know if it was that much or not, but it wasn't. It wasn't over fifty. I know that it's like it's it's pretty good, good decent price for um like a tr a freaking accessory for your Vita. It feels nice. It's pretty much a, a controller making your PS Vita into a controller, and it comes with a battery pack as a bonus. So that's just insane. Um. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, this unboxing. Hope you, I hope I made some chuckles, made some laughs, made people vomit, or otherwise people, wait, made people, what the fuck am I saying? No. Um, hope I made people happy, laugh, and of course, smile. Try to make that into arch. Smile. I can smile. <laughs> you know what? Fuck it. Smile. Yeah, okay. I'm done with stupid jokes. Um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, next video will be on the world ends with you unboxing and yada yada yada. I'm being stupid. Anyway, carbon out. May the wubs be with you, and of course, game on. Like Alpha Mega Sensors and check that guy out. He's a freaking awesome dude. Like Alpha Mega Sin, he is the shit. Skit. You gotta freaking watch him. He's an awesome, awesome gamer. Awesome, informative, and very constructive on what he does. Just pointing that out. I'm procrastinating right now, like I used to do back in my old videos. Uh, you can leave now. Alright, this video off. Okay, I'm about to play me some Hatsune Miku. I'm about to fail this shit. Oh, you guys are still still watching? Nope. Uh. Oh, uh, yeah, um, yeah, um. Ugh. Mm. So how about them j Come on, get off the video now. It's, it's done. Go away. Damn it.